This new owner is Western Foods Canada, and the contract that company offered was accepted by a 95% yes vote during a closed-door meeting with workers yesterday. The new contract, however, means an 11% or 6% pay cut, depending on a worker's seniority, and there will only be about half the workers as before when production resumes at the plant this month, all this according to today's record. The choice to accept that contract, even at reduced pay, is being understood by every single worker I'm meeting this morning. I find it very hard to get out in the workforce. Right now, all the jobs that are available are minimum wage. Or you need extracurricular training, which costs even more money. So, yeah, I'd probably take 11% pay cut and stay there. Roger here certainly understands the choice the colonial workers made. Well, because of the economy the way it is right now, um, I don't think I'd take the chance on starting fresh. How do I know I'm going to find another job? I would take the bad contract. In fact, everyone I've met this morning so far says if they were an older worker at a bankrupt factory, oh, they would definitely take that reduced contract. No one I've met has said they'd be willing to take their chances on the open job market. Mark Douglas, 570 News.